Hi guys, my name is Chad Trofgerman and with me is Jim Mills. Today we are doing a another podcast of sorts, I would say, on what we feel is just an underlooked, underused, amazing piece of software. There are many animation software out there that we've talked about in the past. We do Anime Studio, we do Flash, but this one just kind of fell under the radar. And just recently we've been working with it, we've been doing a lot with it actually. and it's called Google Sketchpad. What's so amazing about it is that it's free. And I would have to say that it's probably on par with Flash and Anime Studio. What are your thoughts on that, Jim? Is that, am I being too uh, dramatic when I say that? Or do you think this is actually comparable to those two software? Yeah, pieces? absolutely, dude. Um, Google Sketchpad is a pretty amazing piece of software. Um, I actually came to learn about it um, from my aunt who um, she was aware of my animation in Anime Studio and she wanted to learn and one day I got an email from her and she sent me this and I kind of thought it was like a joke you know like a little add-on for Google stuff to play around with and I spent uh, like an hour in it and I was just like blown away dude it's very powerful it's very um, it, it's everything you need mm -hmm. yeah no it is and that's just it like I mean, if you look at the tools, which I'll go through more here in depth in a second, I mean, you have your selection tools, you have your line tools, I mean, you have more than just the line tool, you can do, look at all this stuff, arrows, yeah. mm -hmm. curves, a polyline, which is my favorite, yeah, um, mine too. and just so much stuff, you can even import images, I mean, as you can see right here, we have that on screen right now, but you can just click import and you're good, so like, even if you wanted to, take like a sketch like we have here and bring it in as a reference image you can easily do that and that's just it I think a lot of people get confused with you know a lot of features versus quality mm -hmm. um, Anime Studio has a lot of stuff version 10 just came out you know and then there's Flash CC and all that stuff and it has a lot of stuff but who uses all that stuff you know Yeah. It... Have, you, have you touched on anything really I mean when it comes to Anime Studio I don't know like for instance, the motion graph. Who who uses that? You know, nobody uses that. Um, <clears throat> but that's you know a good point. Is those softwares, although you know they're good at what they do, they're you know incredibly bloated with features that nobody ever uses. Um, so uh, yeah, exactly, dude. Um, it's like you're paying for stuff you don't need. It's like uh, those smart TVs that people get now, and it has all these apps and YouTube on it. Nobody uses those and it's the same thing. So you're essentially paying for stuff that you don't need. Where with Google Sketchpad, you get exactly what you need, only what you need, and it's free. Mm -hmm. Well, and the other thing too, you mentioned bloat and that's what I think about. I hate installing software on my computer. I hate mm -hmm. it. Why yeah. would I want to install yeah. software on my computer? So like with this now, for instance, you can just boom, you open up your browser, you're in the document, and you're drawing. Not only that, you can share the drawings with other people and you can expand upon it by having true collaboration because it's all powered by the cloud. And the other thing is when it comes to all of this, I mean, it really, it actually makes me kind of sick to my stomach because, you know, for all these years I've been doing Anime Studio and Flash tutorials, I've been telling people, yes, these are good pieces of software, but then you come to Google, they're giving this away for free. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I, I share your sentiment exactly, dude. It kind of disgusted me a little bit too. But <clears throat> but then again, you know, it's like Google is, you know, every day it seems like they're changing the world for the better, you know, and I'm, I'm very grateful for this software and I can't wait to see what I can accomplish with it, you know. Yeah. I mean, okay, well, enough about the preachy stuff. I mean, you guys know what my stance on that now. now I, if I had to rank them, I mean, I can't really rank them right now. I've just kind of started with this, but I mean... It, it, it's it's kind of night and day right now. But So when you're looking at this, you might be thinking, well, what do we have here? Well, first, <laughs> you know that uh, that big thing with Anime Studio 10? Oh, you can do tabs now? Well, okay. Do you want to pay $300 for that, or do you want to have tabs for free? See? Back and forth. Very easily. Boom. That's all you need. Um, let's take a look here. Anime Studio. Let's see here. Anime Studio. The Add Point tool. That's pretty cool, right? Well, mm -hmm. hey, guess what? Here it is, for free. I didn't pay anything for this, and mm -hmm. I'm just I'm just drawing, just like 
there it is. And yep. you can close the shapes, you can weld them together, you can fill things in. You have a paint bucket tool right here. You can change your colors all very seamlessly. And of course, you have your selection tool so you can move things around, you can resize things. And, and, and also mention that we're doing this at the same time. Yes. We could never do that with Anime Studio no. or Flat. There's so many times where I was working on something and I was like, damn it, I can't get this to work and I need help with it. So then, of course, you know, okay, let's use email, let's send the file to Jim, and then by the time he gets it, I'm working on it, and I get it figured out anyway, and then he sends it back to me, I'm like, well, I don't remember which file I was using now, because I have two files on my computer that are the same thing, what am I supposed yeah. to do? No, no, I, I share your anger, dude, it's, it's very frustrating. So, I mean, the tools here are amazing, and... Why don't we go ahead and show them, well, why don't you show them some of the... Um pre-made shapes. They have some really cool ones. They have, oh like, they have a, a Pac-Man. You know, I'm so caught up in everything else, you know, you kind of forget. Um, yeah, okay, so here's your shapes, and you go to shapes, and look at all this stuff. I mean, I just, I can't even believe it. Like, you can even do 3D here, see? Boom. 3D shape. Wow, I didn't even know about that, dude. That's yeah. awesome. Yeah, I know. It's like, well, that's just it. The more you play with it, the more you just discover. Mm -hmm. You know, it's just like, it's almost and like... It's even, it's even shaded for you, too. That's nice. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, it's right there, shaded. Yeah, um, it's like kind of like opening up a Christmas gift. But then mm -hmm. when you open it up, there's another Christmas gift inside of it. And you just keep yeah. going and going and going and going. And it's just like, you know, yeah. <sighs> there's a text... It's funny you say that, because that actually looks like a Christmas gift. Hey, dude, why don't we go ahead and show them, like... Why don't we each take an arm on the character and draw at the same time to show them the power of that um, feature? Yeah. So yeah, I was talking about the collaboration thing. So okay, which arm are you gonna take? Um, I don't know which one do you want. Um, I will take. I don't care. It doesn't matter to me. <clears throat> okay, I'll I'll do right. Your right or his right? I'll do right. No, his right or your right. Oh, okay. No, yeah, I'll do my right. By the way, if you ever need help with anything, the keyboard shortcuts here are amazing. I mean, yeah, they're great, there's a lot there, so just take a look at that when you have the time. Um, yeah, let's um Okay, I'll take the uh I'll take the right arm. Okay, that's good cuz I already took the left. Okay. So, I'll come in here. I'm just drawing. And yeah, God, I, you know, it just it just works so well. You know, like with Anime Studio, I'd always struggle with the with the tools, you know, trying to get things to work. Yeah. This just works. Everything, everything here is very intuitive. Um, and like with that shape there, can't you like move that down or up if you want oh to? Oh yeah, I can, if I hit shift, I can move it down and up. And if I want to push it back, which I'm about to do, you just hold control and up and down arrow. Now I'll, no, I'll just say I'll have it selected now, I can change it to a flesh color, it so it's great. It took me so long to figure that out in Anime Studio. Like, yeah, I know. It, it just because they they don't they're not very explicit with anything. But you got in all fairness, Anime Studio is a much you know the company behind that is much smaller than Google, so we have to kind of you know keep that in mind. Yeah, but then you turn your attention to Flash, and well, I'm not going to get into that you know yeah. whole Adobe thing. But um, mm -hmm. but you know, and then the bottom line here is you're probably thinking then, well, how do you animate in this? Well, we can actually cover that in another video. But I mean. Like anything, you're going to take, you know, your video editing software and put it to use. But kind of here, what we're just kind of showing you here is the tools and to kind of get, get you guys excited. And, you know, I'm kind of hoping here this, you know, we did a search before we did this video. There's absolutely no tutorials on Google Sketchpad. It's, you know, I almost kind of wonder if like Adobe kind of pays, you know, to kind of like stifle the competition sometimes. Um, I, it wouldn't surprise me, dude. But... You know, in which is which is sickening, by the way. Um, yeah. But you know, here it is, Google Sketchpad. Search, if we want to do more, you know, if you guys want more, just tell us. Tell us what you think, by the way, because we're in love with it. Um, and yeah, that's pretty much it. You know, well, that's really good. Yeah. And then just put it back, and then you can color it. That's really good. Oops, I went back too far. Oh. Yep. Well. You know, Control Z works just as well on here, you know. Yeah. As it does in any program, so it's no biggie. Yeah, that's awesome. So, and there's much more we haven't covered here, but we'll do more on that later. Uh, thanks for watching, guys. Do you have any uh, final thoughts, Jim? No, I just encourage people to go and check this out and in the process, save yourself a little bit of cash, or a lot, actually. Yeah. Okay, thanks for watching, guys, and we'll see you next time.